Cross flow, Cosworth head. So the first thing we're going to want to do is turn this engine clockwise until the pistons are number one at top dead center on the compression stroke, cams, shafts facing out. Got a couple of little holes in here, you probably couldn't see it from the instructions uh, on the camera. Those holes are supposed to line up. So we're coming up on top dead center now. Not so important coming apart, but it doesn't hurt to be accurate all the time. No, our holes are facing each other in here. Crankshaft is a top dead center. Won't hurt to take a look at the instructions before we get started. Famous uh, Wiss Asra. Page through here. Get those cams set up. All right here's the reason we have this out to begin with. Timing chain tensioner was mishandled. So we're going to uh, do that correctly even though the damage has been done. First thing will be off with the head. So you see we have the uh, crankshaft setting at top dead center. I don't know if you can see the two little holes in the camshaft sprocket facing each other. There's one, there's the other. You'll see that I've removed the um, guide here. I generally like to take, take the tension off the tensioner first before I do anything like that. But to remove these bolts, we had to turn it through, get the bottom ones. And so the instructions said to do it this way, so that's the way I did it. Okay, so here's the tensioner, and I uh, looked through the instructions, and they said nothing about this being a ratcheting tensioner. In all fairness to our um, hobbyists that, that put this thing together incorrectly, um, it's not even in the Mercedes-Benz instructions. And uh, on top of that, I worked one of the best Toyota mechanics I ever worked with. I uh, mishandled one of these and destroyed an engine. So it's just something you kind of have to know. Take this part out before you do anything with loosening the chain. I've loosened the outer bolts, and now we're gonna make some sounds of loosening tight head bolts. These are stretch bolts, so we'll measure them. So here we uh, begin to see the damage. See that chain rail is worn through. It uh, will be more obvious when we get the cylinder head off. Set a couple of blocks of wood up on the bench since we're taking the cam off in the head. Some valves are going to be sticking out. This is the Fun part, if you watch enough of these, eventually you're going to see a technician turn the head up and empty all the oil on himself. I'll try not to give you a demonstration of that today. Off with its head! So here we see the damage. Normally when somebody mishandles a timing chain tensioner, we don't see it until the engine comes apart. Got very lucky here. The engine's really quite nice. Uh, you might not be able to see it, but uh, cross hatch is still on the cylinders. Yeah, and so, nice beefy block. It's nice and square. So there we have it. 